Hey, what's up guys? All the Agarita flower locations for group 1, 2, and 3 are what we're going to talk about in this video. I posted an Agarita flower video as soon as the summer update came out. Unfortunately, some people have been having luck and some haven't. At that time, I didn't know that you had to search after 10 p.m. And I've been getting comments the past couple days. People saying that they find them only at nighttime, and then some people blatantly calling me a liar because they go there and they are not at those locations. So hopefully this will make things easier for everybody so you can have a 100 percent success rate so you'll see right there i'm at a location where there should be an agarita flower but it's still before 10 o'clock i come back to the same location you see the time right there it is after 10 p.m so that is the key here knowing which group you have to find for that day and also making sure you are looking for these at the correct time so i've broken it down to an easy way to figure out what group and which flowers you're going to be able to find for group one if you come to this location and you find a tarot card at the little burial site then you're going to know that there are three locations that you're going to find your agarita flower for. And what I did is I ended up setting up my camp conveniently over here to make things a little bit easier. I got these two, went to my camp, I fast traveled over to Armadillo, and then I ended up hitting up the third location. So the first location we're going to talk about is right over here, not too far from Plainview. You're going to see it's up on top of the mountain. We'll bring that up right now. From here, I ended up traveling west. To the next location once i got to this location i picked this flower and as i said because i have a fast travel at my camp i made it easy so i can get these three in one game night so i didn't have to spend too much time went and just fast traveled to armadillo put my waypoint at this location you also can go to mcfarland ranch and travel to this spot to pick this one so next we have group two locations there is a tarot card that will appear at this spot right here and we'll show the exact location. If you come here and find a tarot card at this specific location here, then you're going to know that these two locations are where you're going to find your Agarita flower for this day. One of them is going to be at Lake Don Julio on the hill and then also one here in the Heading Instead area. You can't get these during the same night. So this one's located south of Lake Don Julio up on the mountain in between the cactus. From here, all you need to do is travel to Armadillo, and then you want fast travel to McFarland, and then head over to this location to pick this one. So hopefully this video is going to make things a lot easier, take out any kind of confusion, and there's the aerial view of the location for Group 2. Now for Group 3, if you come to Armadillo and you do not find a tarot card at that location or the burial site, then you're going to know that you have Group 3 for that specific day keep in mind they will rotate every day between group one two and three so you won't be able to get all these flowers on the same day rio del lobo and then near the eye over here is where this location is going to be i ended up setting up my camp in rio bravo to make things easier so i could collect both of these on the same day i ended up coming over to rio del lobo went to my camp fast traveled and then ended up getting the last location so this is just an update video to clear up any kind of confusion however i do feel that if you want xp and cash coins are the best way to go you will see a video popping up on the screen now if you want to check that out appreciate you guys watching and i'll see you next time